Hello. As the COVID-19 crisis progresses, we understand it's difficult to keep track of the continuously changing advice and guidelines. Many of you are worried or confused by rapidly changing messages from many different sources. We want you to know your union is here for you and will be here for you throughout the crisis. I want to assure you we're doing everything we can to support all of our members, whether that's negotiating special leave with your employer, enforcing work health and safety, especially around personal protective equipment, answering your questions or providing updates with the latest information. Your union is here for you and we're working hard to keep you safe. As frontline workers during this health crisis, there's no doubt nurses and midwives are going to experience unprecedented demand. This is why the association is urging the New South Wales government to expedite its planned 5,000 health workforce boost it promised at the last election and allocate extra nursing staff immediately. We're making headway. Our ongoing negotiations alongside other unions have won New South Wales health employees access to 20 days of special paid leave for COVID-19. We're also in discussion with multiple private sector and aged care employers around special leave, isolation strategies and frameworks similar to the public sector. The federal government has implemented restrictions on visitors to aged care facilities and many local health districts are also limiting non-essential meetings. In light of this, and to ensure association staff do not place unnecessary pressure on the health system, will not be visiting hospitals or aged care facilities unless the visit relates to a work health and safety matter and it is urgent. We are making available teleconferencing options for branches that need to hold meetings. We'll be in contact with branch secretaries in coming days around those arrangements. Rest assured, you have our full support throughout this time We've increased the numbers of officers available to answer your questions or concerns. You may be asked to leave a short message or send your message by email, and one of those officers will either call you back or respond to your email as soon as possible. We know you want your question answered as soon as possible, and we are changing our systems to do that in light of the new circumstances we face. We're also sending regular updates regarding your rights and entitlements. Given the increase in demand for advice and the need for members to contact us outside business hours, we're working on improved methods to speed up those response times. There will be changes. Please work with us if we try to respond to your queries as quickly as possible. If your inquiry relates to COVID-19, in the first instance, please check our website at thelamp.com.au where all the latest information about government guidelines and recommendations, personal protective equipment, and your workplace entitlements are available. Members can also log into Member Central via the main website to access our frequently asked questions about COVID-19 related issues. We've made a decision to cancel our own education events for the foreseeable future, and our annual conference will not proceed in July 2020. Our Committee of Delegates meetings will be conducted online. We are complying to the public health guidelines and directives. These are extraordinary times and as health professionals, it's critical for us to educate and decrease anxiety within the community. Please take care of yourself and of each other. We are with you every step of the way.